Uh, this agreement is not about Iran or about anyone else. It's about bringing our countries together and making sure that we work together uh, to deliver prosperity and security for our people. And we are confident that we are in a place that will deliver that uh, and uh, that the leaderships of uh, all the countries will be working very hard to make sure that we are coordinating our regional policies and our efforts to uh, contribute to the safety, security and stability of the region. When you think about what's been happening over the last year or so um, with the Abraham Accords, for example, that was seen as a big win, not just for the region, but also for Jared Kushner and President Trump. Does this agreement rack up for a win for the Trump White House? I think this agreement racks up a win for the region, first of all, uh, a win for all of us. And uh, absolutely, President Trump and uh, uh, Jared Kushner contributed to reaching this agreement in uh, uh, in uh, working very closely with uh, Kuwait, who has been uh, working on this uh, for some time. So uh, we are very appreciative of the support and efforts uh, that the Trump administration uh, has given for us to reach this agreement. Saudi Arabia's foreign minister there essentially praising the agreement as not just a win for the region, but also as a win for President Trump and Jared Kushner. Of course, President Trump has just two weeks left in office and a Biden presidency could chart of a different course for Riyadh. Of course, uh, President-elect Biden, when he was on the campaign trail, was, was pretty harsh when he came to talking about Saudi Arabia. I asked the foreign minister if this deal was in any way to get back in Washington's good graces ahead of the inauguration. This isn't about Washington. It's about uh, the region and the priorities that our countries have. Uh, and our region, our leaders uh, saw that, uh, they, uh, that uh, the interest of our people was in resolving this dispute. And we were able to come to a resolution finally that was satisfactory to all of the countries that addressed uh, our concerns and that uh, satisfied uh, 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 all the parties and makes uh, certain that we have now a basis for much stronger GCC cooperation and much stronger uh, uh, efforts, not just, uh, by the way, uh, regional security-wise, but also in the economic integration field.